Fortnite uh, and really the free-to-play movement define 2018. Some of them are more scammy, more kind of tricky than other. I was really angry about that bullet thing. me, me no. It's just scared. I think he is actually he's a little bit scared. scared. He's indeed. saying that he's more angry than he is because he's just scared and he doesn't want to admit it. You do think though that the, the character would just find the bullet or something? Do you know what I mean? They can, well, they can write their way around that. There was only two zombies. There was only two zombies in that building. They had hundreds of bullets. There's a few more. Hunters. But there was ones that you, you were never going to shoot at anyway. But she's really angry about that and that's a really bad he's start. He's really angry because he's rubbish and he's scared. Yeah, and he missed the door. There was only two doors. He's not going to And he was looking at the no pictures of the, the busty ladies on the wall and that's not really... That's like five minutes he was staring at them. And but that's kind of not what he... Well, it's not no, that kind of guy, no. Or, or he, that's, He'll not let you see that, all the bums and the boobs and all that. And, and he was just looking at it all the time and you think, that's why he fired off all those bullets. It's a metaphor. Fair enough, he had fired all the bullets and then that dramatic... Like all the bullets that he found because he never fucking looked for them. What was that? I mean, there was no bullets in that fucking gun. Oh. Is that what you said about these? <laughs> so we're a wee bit into the game now. You I'm, are. It's you that's playing. Yeah. It's me that's playing a wee bit into the game now. Now, I feel almost like... Sometimes, here's the thing about reviewing games, sometimes you get far enough in where you kind of go, Right, I kind of feel as if I've got the feel, obviously I was the one playing it, but the feel for what it's like. If your perspective watching it, what's your take so far? Well, for me, I wish you'd start boarding up windows. That's incredibly frustrating I to watch. I think that's an important thing yeah. included. It's obviously a new thing, isn't it? Right. And Robert's not grasping that at all. We've been sort of hinting at it loudly while you're playing at it, going, maybe board up his windows. It's like when you get a dog a new toy, but uh -huh. you need to show it to him. It's not playing with it properly. Oh. I don't know how I feel about the Does boarding up us? the windows thing. Well, you're obviously very anti it because you're not doing it and it's leading to a lot of really tense, frantic situations. Because you run out of bullets. If yeah. You, you go and examine a window and then you decide to use the boards and then it just boards and nails just all appear on the window just like that. Boom. Yeah. And it just feels a wee bit. Shite. It's weird that some of the puzzles you need tools for, but he's ready to go with that. He he's ready to go, he's got nails. He's got his, his black and decker a tool bag with him. Guys feel strange, I don't know. Do I feel strange? I do feel, yeah, I feel on edge. I think the sound design is just incredibly, it's put me on edge. And you're, you've got a problem with the boards going up black quickly, but you don't mind the key floating. The well, game the other old school good. elements of the game. It does look good, but it looks does look good. Frantic. The game to me feels remarkably old-fashioned and I know it's a remake of an old game right is it it is it was out before to me it feels unbelievably old-fashioned though and you can feel it like just in the way the game progresses I think to myself sometimes like there's a lot of nostalgia involved in this isn't there I wonder if somebody coming completely fresh to this in the year 2019 what they would think about all this cutting doors open and finding mad wee keys with symbols on it shite Mm. Yeah, well, you go play a wee bit more. I think it's building up to something. I think, I think it's got something new. I was just saying that to Gerald. There, Gerald. Gerald, know. sorry, yeah. Gerald. Ryman. Uh -huh. uh, the, in the olden, you know, the, the old Resident Resi games are old. They would they hesitate and leave you for five or six hours and just bugging you, bug it off, and just leaving you. But I don't think they're going to do. I think they're going to get hit with something pretty soon. Yeah. Maybe. Now that you have learned to control your ability to relax your body, I want you to strengthen your ability to control what you experience. Place your hands on your back with the palms facing up. You are breathing very slowly. Concentrate. Entire. You all right? Do you feel strange or anything? Lucius 3 is available on Steam, it's about 15 quid, and it's a scary game, so watch yourself. I haven't played Lucius 1 or 2, but as soon as I saw the opening cutscene that you're watching right now, I thought we're on to a winner. Because I know, because I'm a professional video editor, so I know like slick cutscene production when I see it. Beautiful music. Beautiful cutscene, 
spot on bus physics, can he fault it so far, Lucius 3. Uh, obviously that's a cutscene though, so that's no representative of what the game's like to play, this is uh, Lucius 3 here, using his powers. How did he do that? How did he do that? Nice. You'll notice that there's an awful lot of fade to blacks. I don't know what the reason for that is. If any of you make games, tell me what the reason for that is. Is it just they haven't put the game that doesn't fit all fit together? That's the way I think about it. Cause I'm an editor, I think they haven't they haven't they like gelled all the bits together, so it's just constantly fucking. Fading the black. Stone falls down. Fade to black. Hello. They come up with this really good idea early on in the game, it's a crack or so, is that you've got a camera and Lucy S3 has to go around taking pictures of all the guests. It's a wee bit worrying because it is a wee bit of a pedo party. I really must be going back to the motel. Norman Bates is there, they steal all the ideas. All the ideas, they'll lift them all. Cause fuck it, why not? Hello. Fucking yes. <coughs> Hello there, I'm madam. That's the devil. I think I can't remember. It's a stinker. It's absolutely honking. Again, this is a cutscene. Show uh, more representative of what it is like to play the game. Here is Lucius Three using his powers. By, I'll just show you. Everything takes ages, so you'll need to wait. Don't go anywhere. It's about to happen. There you go. So Lucius 3 used these powers to make a uh, crow blow up or something. That's what the game's like, so don't get any fancy ideas about the devil and good dialogue or any of that pish. It's uh, it's uh, it's f it's frightening in a way. It certainly gave me a wee bit of a fright when I thought that I was going to get a scary game and it was turned out to just be Shenmue with fucking blood bags. He's got the special powers, Lucius 3, but he needs a flathead screwdriver to get into that robot. Mirrors don't work properly. There's only about three mirrors in the whole game, but they don't work properly. The frame rate's off or something. See what I mean? He's moving at the wrong speed. Unless that's deliberate, in which case, bravo. This is what Lucius 3 is. This is what the game is. Walking about, talking to a few people, looking at things. Check the length of that cunt's arms. He's floating as well. Lucius 3. It's a scary game. Maybe he's a ghost. Maybe that's why he was floating, because he was a ghost. I'm patching, I'm patching things up myself here. I came out of the kitchen for the wrong angle there, see? That guy's meant to be making breakfast, but I came out for the wrong angle, so fade to black, fade up, and I'm at the other side of the kitchen. Problem solved. Next, this guy's not got anything on his horn. And I stood there watching him for ages, and it was all the sound effects of like, dishes getting washed and fridges getting opened, but he was just... What's this three? You alright? You feel strange or anything? No, I can't recommend that at all. Uh, if you get 15 notes in your pocket and you play Steam stuff, get Dusk. Look at what that looks like, the games. Except it's all slick, obviously. Like, like games should be nowadays. But it's very atmospheric. Very slick. Very, very cool game. Dusk. Only 15 quid. A really, really cracking shooting game. Oh, I don't feel so good. I feel strange. I'm conflicted. You've started boarding up the windows though, and that was good. I found that was a... Uh, that was good. Glad you started boarding up the windows. I don't know it's why. No, it's not very scary, I don't No, it's not very scary. I just kind of shake the feeling that I just don't really know why it needs to exist. I don't know why or why it really needs to exist. But I'm going to play some there, but... I can't, I need to stop my speed run because I, it's too... I'm just t so tired. Are you alright? Do you feel strange I just feel really, really tired. It must be about four in the morning now. I'll anyway. be 42 this year. Let me check the time. It's not even midnight. It's not even midnight. No. 
And, and to be honest, boys, I'm usually in bed by about 10 anyway. Max. 